Hey guys, welcome back to Matty J Plays and welcome back to another week and another new course playthrough. This week we are at Conus Caldar. I mean, I have no idea if I'm pronouncing that right. Sounds like I'm sneezing. Sneezing. A course by Quifa, which again, apologies if I'm not pronouncing that right. Um, picked out a real puzzler, didn't I? Let's have a look at the course though. This is a four pinned 7,700, oh, 7,745 yards from its white tees. Um, three T sets, red, green, and white. It's a par 72. Um, not had massive amount of play, so let's give it a go and see what happens. As always, I've kept the settings. We're playing for the longest tees. We're playing on pin set three, on moving day, and everything else is as Quifa, the designer, intended. Um, let's get in. Connors Calada. Something like that. Whatever. I'm not going to say that too often because it's confusing. But let's go. As always, this is in my society, guys. Play Matty J. So it's play Matt underscore E underscore J. If you want to join and come in and test your metal against me week in, week out, one course a week. That's all it is. And I play it every week. I try to pick some new courses. I got fed up with the major courses kicking my ass. So I went for this one this week, um, which I don't think is for the major design. I think it's just for the guy's pleasure who's designed it. And sometimes that works out better. That is a terrible opening swing, and it's going to work out just fine. Little play. Going to have an awkward okay, stance. About Wind and stance ten. all taking this to the left. So I'm going to have to loft up a 150 yard 9 iron, and I'm going to need to hit this further this way. And well, that's a better strike. Hopefully, I've judged that correctly. And that's a nice shot into this opening that's first tee fine on the pin, rather. I've got to lose my mind. One right, 152 30. green speeds. Okay, looks like we got average wind. Fairly fast greens, but that should be an opening birdie. And that is a great way to start the day after that shambolic opening drive. We win a fair way, and we are looking good. Let's see how the boys are getting on. Ohio State Mike, who's been tearing up my courses of late, is at minus three through four. He even finished under par on last week's course, which I absolutely hated. Mick is back on blazing as well. Nice to see Mick. Um, this feels right. Slight fast is going to leak me out to the left there. Hopefully it holds this green and gives me a putt, which it there does. We, Good shot. So we have we a 16, have a foot, 16 putt, foot putt, one inch down. I like to bring this in a bit because I do tend to hit my putts a little harder than most. So I'll bring it into 14. Let's see if I can judge this break. Giving it too much? I have given it too much. Not bad. All right, this next putt. Not bad. But just a little too much. Perfect swing line on those two putts. So long may that continue because my swing line, as you know, has been erratic of late. And after that one, you'll stay right there at one under par. And we're one under for two. Chasing Ohio State Mike and Mick at the minute. Leo is back in and playing. It's good to see. Minus one through three. And Danny Wilder's there. Plus three through five. Nice to have you back. Awesome. Four on this one. So it is a drivable par four. Mm. Let's have some fun. Oh, I needed the wind to kick in more than that. I was hoping the wind would bring me back more than that. I purposely played for that fast, but I think I just set that too far out to the right. But it's going to make it up there. And it's keeping, it's getting better. Keep turning. Ooh, I traveled, traveled a bit on that green. Traveled a bit. They're pacey greens. 152 is a pacey green. But we have an eagle putt. And we do love an eagle putt. Manny J loves an eagle putt. So this is 34 feet, a foot uphill. Mm. Is it going to move this much? Let's find out. Oh, is it going to move that much? In oh, it is. It yeah, nearly overturned. That but that is a glorious 34 foot putt for Eagle. Sending us to three under through three. And we are happy with that. Nice way to start the round. 
So I think, guys, I've, my videos with my TGC tours um, in Platinum, which are 40 odd minutes long, doing two rounds at a time, haven't been doing great. Um, it is a lot to ask to watch a 40 minute video, to be fair. So I think I'm going to switch up my format a bit. I'll probably play TGC offline. I'm going back to these course walkthroughs because TGC was taking up too much of my time. Um, oh, this is a tricky hole. Um, so, yeah, I, I, if I have a good round in TGC, I'll upload it. But majority of my time will be doing course walkthroughs. And I'm going to try and get into a hints, hints and tips type um, session. I actually want to deal off this a little bit. So do a few videos just... Pretty much just describing how I play. Um, I don't like, there's no yeah, prescription to this game. Drop. Play it how you want. I don't come up with formulas or anything shit like that. Not my style. Um, but I do have a few hints and tips that might be useful. So I'm going to do a little series on them. And if you find them useful, great. If you don't, no worries. So this is a par five. We had 250 odd yards in. I'm hoping this just kicks on and up to the flag. That was the plan. And that has worked out pretty, pretty good. Nice and this is for go a double eagle. If you think this. So, with a bit of concentration on this 12 foot putt. It's be glorious. Oh, it's not going to turn, is it? Ah, no, no, I didn't no, think. Really Look at that. Looking back, it's all moving. Don't know how That's that didn't right. take that break. That's annoying. That's annoying. That could have been two eagles on the bounce. I'm going to put it right in the mix early on. But we're four through four. We will take that. Leo's a steady two under through five. He's finding his feet back in this game. He, the guy tears up um, All right, let's have a nice tee shot. EA. Nicely in that fair the other way. game, the game we don't like to mention, but stole a lot of players for a while. But I feel a lot uh, are starting to trickle back to 2K. Um, it was nice shiny. It was something shiny and new for a while, but didn't quite have the um, substance for me. And I think that's down to just the brilliant course designers in this game, to be fair, which is why I do these walkthroughs, to showcase them. And this is a lovely course so far. Sifa? Kuifa? That's a hard name to say. I must be pronouncing it wrong. Maybe it's a silent W in a Sifa. Alright, let's sync this for Birdie and peace out. What do you say? Can't be Queefer, can it? This putt's good so far. All right, we are five through five. One, and that's back to back birdies. Look at those trees have got a lot of movement in them. Don't know why I've been distracted by that. <laughs> I don't normally get distracted by we win through the trees, but there's a lot going on. All right, five through five. Ohio State Mike or Mike Heron, another great designer, guys. Five under through eight. Mix five through ten. So they are keeping pace with each other, those two. Having a bit of a battle in my society. It's a nice looking tee shot. Yeah, I like this. Big wide fairways. Nice course. Feels like a nice chilled out round. Until I lose my shit and rage. Let's go. 167. This might be a risk, guys, but hey. Shit or bus, right? Oh, I've I yeah, I snatched at that. I snatched at that. Hopefully it kicks up and somehow kicks right, maybe. Nope, it kicked left. Yeah. I snatched at that, sadly. Okay. Um, no I knew it didn't quite have the legs, so I um, up shoved that forward for like an idiot. Shot. I shouldn't have done that. That was not good golf. That, that's a nice chip. And oh! Oh, 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 it's just nasty. That, that is a delightful chip for Matty J. As we know, those do not go in very often for me. So when they do, I am going to celebrate them. It's like a birthday. Once a year, I might get one of them. That's glorious. Don't need to see the replay, though. Six under par currently. Six under through six. Tearing up this front line. Mike's at 6 through 9. And Mick's at 6 through 11. So those boys are having a bit of a battle. Leo's steady at 2 through 7. We are on the 7th hole. Let's see what we can do. Mm -hmm. A little bit of laugh. A little bit of spin. This should be good. Nice. Can hit it perf a right. little push out to the right. It's going to keep me out there, sadly. A tiny little, see my little swing line? It'll come around a bit, but 
It would have been glorious about that tiny little push. Approach there. But this is quite a straightforward right, a green. Or so it seems. I hate these ones, though. It seems straightforward, and then they just move all over the shop with me. Oh, Not a great on, swing line. Uh, we've That's made the 22 footer, fantastic. and we keep this this streak going. We're at six under through the last five holes. Seven Could have been, should have been seven. That eagle putt is still haunting me. Um, where I missed a 12 footer, yeah, just didn't turn. On but we're on the eighth. Another big wide fairway, 488 yards, par four. Let's blast it up there. This one looks pretty safe. Thanks, John. It's pretty safe. This one is around 180 yards. Long ass par for this puppy, but this one 78 should be good. Touch a D loft, touch a spin, and a little bit of a fast. I feel. Oh, perfect. Wanted a fast there. Didn't get it. Hence, it leaked out to the right. But it's not a bad shot. That's safe. Here we go. Drop this one for birdie. Not a bad shot. That's a tough par four. Feel I'll be making a shot up on the course if I can get a birdie on this hole. It's getting there. Which we do, Lee do. And it drops in for birdie number. And we're six, eight through eight, and it feels like Matty J is back playing some good golf after a few rogue weeks. And after that one, you are at eight. Swing line issues, connectivity issues, all sorts going on. But we're back, it's running smoothly, and look at that, straight eight, 888, eight, eight. me, Mick, and Ohio. It's a battle, boys. It's a battle. Okay, longer par and I love it. On this hole. If you feel like you're up for the challenge, guys, as I say, jump in. It's called Play Matty J, just the reverse of my handle on YouTube, which is Matty J Plays. We're about Come in. Yards out from here. Give it a shot. Oh, no. I'm going to, oh, no. Can't hit that. I'll be miles long. I'm gonna have to try and de loft. That's gonna be so short. I'm gonna have to try and de loft this 199. This this could go wrong, folks. This is a tricky one for me. Another long par four. I've hit it as I intended. I just needed to kick up now. Okay. That's not bad. Betwixt and between clubs there. I'll take that outcome. Well done. I'll take that outcome all day, 16 feet away, got myself a putt at it. I'll stop turning. Ah, oh, ruined my little streak. That would have been 9 through 9, but we're 8 through 9. We're holding steady. Mike's at 9 through 12, Mick's at 8 through 14. So it's going to be a battle between us three. Good hole. We've got a par four for this one. It's going to be a bad... Oh, this is tough. This is tough. I think that kicks you all the way. I might just play into this gully, actually. Oh, shit. I didn't push that forward at all. I'm not even going to reach it. Oh, my God. 92% power, and I just did not even... I just bailed out of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nice to have that one back. Not the time to be Second doing that, Matt. Shot on the tenth. John, you are right. It would be nice to have that one back. Sadly, I'm not going to have that one back. I'm going to have to hit a six iron into this, um, which is not going to go well. Needs to be one hell of a strike from there. Yeah, it's going to be short. Sadly, that slow is going to hold that up. Okay, third shot. In it's a tricky, tricky ask. If you can make these greens, so there's not much movement on these greens, but that was just a absolute bottler from me. I haven't bottled a shot that badly in a while, and that one's too fast. It's got to sit down. Okay, and this one to save the hole. Okay, let's get out. Let's run away Good. from this and move a par. That's gonna work. Uh, let's pick this back up on an X. That's two pars on the bounce, but we got three par fives now. Boom, boom, boom. Let's do this. Oh, there's a lot of par fives in this back nine. There's four par fives on this back nine, boys. So, state mics 10 through 13. They can't be that easy a par five. Mix at 8 through 15 as well. Most boys are staying static. Leo's at 3 through 8. Take advantage of this nice par five hole. Oh, that is, that is dirty. Does it get over there? Let's find out. Feels a risk at this moment in time to be going for this. Oh, <laughs> threading the needle with that fairway. 
probably wasn't worth the risk because you ain't getting there. Let's loft this up. Let's loft this up. What's the worst that can happen, eh? Must be feeling lucky. It's not going to get anywhere near, but... That's not bad. That worked out hey, all right. There we go. Oh, no. And this is our third shot. Oh, no. And you're two strokes off the lead. I might put this, you know. This might be mad. I might put this. I'm just more comfortable with a putter in hand. I'm trying to do my mental mental vision state here. It looks like it's moving. I think more right to left, weirdly, at the end. No, this is definitely more left to right. Not massive. I'm going to go there. Let's hit it. Oh, shit. That did not come off. I need the foot downhill to take this up. I need to pick up a bit of speed because that did not come out of that fringe as I expected. <laughs> oops. Great line. Just oops. Expected that to come out of that fringe a little bit quicker than that. But that's all right. Nice work. That's Take a birdie. Number seven today. Won't be many eagle in that. And we are nine through 11. This is good golf. Two more par fives to go. Let's see what we can do. Here we go. Par five. Here up. we go. Let's go, John. Put this over here. I'm getting these big slows. I'm holding on to the stick and kind of just forgetting to push forward. Luckily, that one did not impact me, which is weird. Yeah, let's hit the 214. That time I made sure I didn't hold on to it and shoved that forward as hard as I could. Hopefully, this just sits. Oh, that's a great Let's shot into this par five, and we have Let's an eagle attempt. This 13 foot putt. Our third eagle attempt. I mean, technically, we had one on the last hole, but I'd never hit it. Never really had a chance. I've hit this one, though. Oh. Oh, yeah, there it is. That's Two of the four right. eagles in the bag. We are 11 under through 12. Are we going to do enough to hold off the challenge of Mike, under par for you. Mr. Mike Heron? He's 11 through 15. Mix at 7 through 17. Just fell back a bit there, Mick. Disastrous back nine, my friend. This he was doing so well. Not disastrous, feels a bit harsh. No. Let's call it a challenging oh, back nine. Done. Nice swing. But I'm enjoying these par fives so yeah, far. If you hit the fairways, you're doing okay. We're going to need a little extra club, I think. We play the 178 in. This should be good. This should be good. The wind should bring me back to the right. And it should hopefully just kick up. Oh, stay. Yeah, <laughs> we were so uh, close to rolling back down. Look <laughs> how close we were to rolling back down. Why it's making me hit it this hard. I'm not hitting it that hard, guys. You're mental. I'll hit it this hard. Get there. Oh, oh and two oh, eagles oh, on the bounce, and them's all she wrote, you would imagine. You would imagine that should, should you are suffice. Under power. Let's see what Mike's doing now. He's at 12 through 16, so he has a couple of holes to get that shot. Let's see how this I just mustn't Part drop three. one now. Oh my god. So this is maybe where Mick dropped a shot, because this is not fun. That doesn't get there. That's way too long. <sighs> gonna have to hit the 192. I don't think it gets there, guys. I'm gonna have to hit it. Yeah, that was a good swing. Well I tried to 102% it, which I did. And that should be fine now. I had to do a pretty, pretty strong swing on that one, yeah, which is not like me. I don't like overpowering a, stuff. That's a good little approach shot. But it worked out all right. This one for the birdie. Could have done with an easier putt than that, though, folks. But what a display. Eighth birdie of the day. Yeah. That is 14 through 14. And we are absolutely cooking. Absolutely cooking on gas. What a round this has been. That one, your current score, a veritable 14 under par. 14 through 14. And here we have a lovely par four hole. Guys, if you're enjoying the golf here, please, I'm going to try and land between these two bunkers. This is going to be tricky. 
leave a like. If you're new, please subscribe. And that was Good tricky. Off, there was no way I was landing between those two bunkers, but stop before it. Perfect. Now this one's about 190 or so to the pin. God, some tricky shots, man. It's a nice long course. It is a quite a tough course. So I'm just playing some great golf at the minute. Job, I like it though. It's nice and open. Feels feels breezy. Why did I change my mind there? Never change your mind, Matt. You know your own rules. Nice putt. And that is the correct it. rule. And we are at 15, three holes to play, another par five coming up. Par is, is it too much to ask for a fourth eagle? And Mike looks team, like he got to 13 under, par which is five. some epic shooting. Great shooting, Mikey boy. Oh, and I've chunked it again. Why do I keep doing this? Looks like it'll be safe. Why do I keep doing this? This was a reachable par five. And now I've chunked the shit out of it, but we got a shot at it still. And we're going to take it. We're going to take it. Now this has got to kick up. Kick up and then just chill out. Oh, go on. Oh, go on, you dirty little minx. Oh, <laughs> all right. Gives us a shot. Gives us a shot for a fourth eagle. Oh, it's getting there. Oh, we absolutely wet our pants on that one. That should have been four eagles. That is a gimme putt for me most days of the week, but sadly not today. 16 through 16. Let's see can we do a perfect one, uh, 18 through 8? Jesus. Oh my god. Let's try 230. I don't know what the club is here into this. Genuinely don't. So 230 felt like the right maths. Have we called it right? This has got to sit. Or we'll go in. Or we'll go in. Oh, that's not going to sit. Oof. Second shot on Come on 17. In. Let's go for a chip. Let's do this. We got this, boys. It's an aggressive chip. Ah, oh, no! Without that eagle on the last, we suddenly blew our perfect round. Okay, time to head Ugh. to the next hole. Ugh. How irritating. Oh, 16, under 16 is still hole. fucking great golf, guys, but that should have been an eagle on the last. That was a tough par He's three, mine. 117 right on yards downhill. I mean, wow. There is some elevation changes in this puppy. And we're going to loft up this. Play this. Play the slope to the left. This green all runs left to right, so we've got to be on this left-hand side of the pin, which we are. Now we just need it to sit, which it does. It's run out a little bit longer than I'd have liked, your worth here. Top but it was a good board. shot. Making shots like that, think you're better than me? It was a good shot. And yes, John, I think I'm better than you. To write a 55 down on your Can we write a 55? Today? Are we going to get a 55? Oh, we right. do. And that is 17 through 18. You can't say better than that, boys. Lovely course. I will put the course title on the screen because genuinely can't pronounce it. Conzalara something. Connors Calder. Connors Calder by Quifa. Get out there. Give it a go, boys. Brilliant course. Have, enjoy myself today. Take it easy. Peace out.